Today we continue our work on the Underworld teams by painting the Steelheart Champions. Alright, now this is a three model team. Uh, we've started things off by doing our normal base coat in gray and white. We're going to start things off by doing a coating of agros dunes over all of the sand areas of the base. Then using some basilicanum gray, I'm going to paint over all of the armored sections of the model. This will get complemented by some dry brushes in later steps. Now using some Blood Angels Red, I'm doing a coating over all of the fabric sections of the model. Now I'm doing this just light enough to still be able to see the highlights and shadows of the dry brushing, but just heavy enough to not leave any uh, brush lines. Next we're going to prep the sword by doing a medium coating of Artist Law of Silver. Now using some Grainite Steel, we're going to paint this kind of scaled section on the front of his tunic, and then using a makeup brush, I'm doing a uh, dry brushing over the rest of the armor. Then I'm going to do a light coating of Griff Charger Gray over all of the stonework on the base. Next I'll use Gilman Flesh for the face tones and follow it up with some Gore Grunt of Fur for the hair. Now using Retributor Armor, we're going to paint up a lot of the detail sections of the model. I'm using this to paint both of the pauldrons, as well as a few of the uh, more detailed areas of the model. Now once I've got the major detail areas done, the longest part of this color is edge highlighting each of the armor sections individually. But once it's done, it really brings a lot of extra depth to the model. Next, I'll use some Basilicanum Gray to do a light coat over the silvered section of the sword. Now using some Snakebite Leather, I'm going to touch up the sword handle as well as the scabbard on the back of his belt. Then follow things up with some Blood Angels Red to paint this one pauldron, but not the other one since I want to preserve the details there. Using some Grey Knight Steel, I'm going to do a light dry brush over the Lion Head Pauldron. Then using some Agrax Earthshade, I'm going to go over the entirety of the model's base. And then follow it up with some Null Oil. This is going to go over all of the armored sections, but not on the cloth sections. And to finish things up, we're going to do a little bit of wildwood on the one exposed root, and some sap green for all of the leaves on the base. And here we are with the finished team. All in all, it didn't take that long to paint these guys up. I think it took maybe an hour and a half for the entire team. Alright everyone, so thank you very much for watching. Please hit that like button, subscribe for future content, comment in the comment section, let me know how I'm doing, and we will see everyone next episode.